The new public health order that we're announcing will require San Franciscans to remain at home with exceptions only for essential outings. That got weird quick. Welcome to Wolf of Down. It's Friday, March 20th. Been locked in the house for the last eight days. The coronavirus is real. San Francisco's on a lockdown except for essential businesses and a restaurant is an essential business. So Wafer Tavern, we're closed to the public. We're only doing takeout. And then that's been kind of touch and go, but we had a good idea a couple of days ago and that's to get a food truck. And you think a guy has been hosting a show on food trucks the last 10 or 11 years, I'd have one, but this is my first food truck. So uh, the Wafer Tavern Fried Food Truck is born, and we're gonna take the idea of curbside to different curbs in San Francisco, right? So this is the thing about it. When you're in business for yourself, you fight, fight, fight all day long. You never give up whatever it takes to survive, because it's not even about me. We have 120 employees in this business, and we're fighting for them, most important thing. Hi, I'm Andrea. I'm the events director here at Wayfair Tavern. I also handle all of our marketing and our social media. I'm really excited for this food truck that we're going to launch. I think it's going to give us a chance to really get out in the community in a safe way. I'm just really happy that we have this opportunity. Hi, my name is Scott Quinn. I'm the executive chef of Wayfair Tavern here in San Francisco. And I am standing in front of the Wayfair Tavern food truck. We're gonna start doing takeout delivery from the food truck, meal packages, trying to keep everybody fed. We should be kicking off sometime next week, so look for us. I'm Tony Marcel, I'm partners with Tyler Florence at Wayfair Tavern here. We're gonna be out on the road with our new food truck. We're having to re-strategize here, but we wanna keep it going, uh, cause that's who we're, what we're built of. We appreciate everything you guys have done out there. Let's make it happen, all right? First of all, thank you, cause the truck looks fantastic. Yeah, it really does. I mean, that was, what was that, five days? I had to pull my... Underground people that are still yeah. working. Yeah. And it's in good shape, right? It's got what we need. It's, it's in great shape. Two burners, four baskets. It's got a little pond check. Yeah. For the most part, we're, we're going to focus on fried chicken. We're yeah. going to live to the promise. It's going to be yeah. the world's greatest fried chicken truck. Yeah. We'll blow it up. I All think right. it's going to be fun, man. You Welcome to the apocalypse. <laughs> <laughs> My God. <laughs> Come on in. We can cook and we can stay safe and we can give people exactly what they want without a lot of interaction. So we got one we thing for 25 bucks, people, right? right? Yeah, we got one thing for 25 bucks. That'll be, that'll be dinner for two, fried chicken, two sides and a dessert, right? Whatever that is, yeah. Yep, and then we'll do a fried chicken sandwich. Yep. That sounds good. And we'll just kind of keep the menu really simple. This restaurant won't go down, right? When you got a good team and you believe in what you're doing yeah. and you got a great product and you got good culture inside the restaurant, uh, everybody's on your side. So I think this yeah. is gonna be great. Be good. I'm excited about this, man. Hey everybody, it's Tuesday. It's lunchtime. It's uh, about quarter till one. The Wafer Tavern fried chicken truck is right behind me. That's the truck, kids. Coming in hot. We're gonna go set up and go sell some chicken to some people and just try to create some humanity in the city that we love so much, man. So San Francisco, we love you. We're gonna stay together as a community. Stay safe. We're gonna set up here. This feels like a really good spot. We're right on main highway here. This is Ocean Beach in San Francisco in the outer Richmond. We're just going to set up here and try to bring some hot fried chicken to a lot of people that you know haven't had a good whole cooked meal in quite some time. So uh, let's just do it. It'll be great. That was a nice little pop. I'm gonna leave my team to carry on throughout lunch. I got some take out myself. Uh, we're gonna head back to the studio. We actually have this really interesting live event tonight. Chefs are coming up with very interesting ways to kind of keep the ball rolling, man. We are too. Could be a lot of people tonight, could be fun. Let's go. We're gonna head to the studio and start cooking again. Back to the studio, not here. What's up, everybody? Um, God, this fried chicken so good. Out of all the like crazy things we've come up with, the fried chicken is it the best thing? I've definitely eaten more than my weight in 
wafer tapper fried chicken. <laughs> oh, it's so good. Here we go, folks. We're about to go live in our little humble studio test kitchen here in Northern California. We've got two amazing dishes coming up. We're gonna do a roasted root vegetable salad with burrata, a balsamic honey dressing and arugula. That's gonna be really delicious. And then also chicken marsala with Parmesan polenta. This has kind of been a dream come true for us to be able to just to kind of go live whenever and wherever. And here we are. We're making the most of it. I'm telling you, like this is, I think, one of the greatest lessons about adversity, right? Whatever happens, you keep the show going. And that's what we're doing right now, man. We're about to go live. And uh, <laughs> wish us luck. This could be really good. I'm so excited to be doing this with you right here, right now. We are not gonna let coronavirus slow us down. So we're gonna make two dishes for you today. We're gonna be making a roasted root vegetable salad with a balsamic honey dressing, burrata, citrus, and arugula. That's gonna be our first course. And then our second course, we're gonna be making an amazing mushroom chicken marsala with Parmesan polenta. Does that sound good to you? We love you out here in California. We want to cook for you. Uh, we want this to be our new hangout spot right here in the little hangout test kitchen. And uh, we will see you guys next time on Wolf It Down Live. Thank you so much. Appreciate that. That was good. It took a pandemic to go live.